In tonight's job center, we have a young man who had to quit college to take over the role of breadwinner after his father passed on, leaving him a family of seven to take care of. Here is Joy Dorin Bira with the story of Daniel Nzimbi. self-taught artist, I was born with the talent, but I've learned, uh, I've learned the different techniques through friends and through other artists. He quit school in 2006, three months after he enrolled into college where he was pursuing a diploma in community development. This after his father passed on, leaving behind a young family that left him with no option but to step up and support the family of seven. My dad, my dad died of cancer in 2006 and uh, my mom, uh, since she didn't have a job and we had this, uh, we had this huge uh, medical bill. With no hope of fathering his education, Daniel sought a job with an art gallery to raise money for his upkeep. He was paid 800 shillings a day but even then he was not content. He quit his job to be able to raise more money for the family. He decided to paint on his own and sell his artwork to friends. Sometimes I lack orders, sometimes I have so many orders. On a good month I can make 60,000 to 80,000 shillings. 60,000 shillings, off of which he pays 25,000 shillings as mortgage for his workstation that also doubles as his home, supports his family and keeps the business going. Daniel, whose primary income comes from friends and door-to-door -door marketing, is seeking capital to boost his business, but there is a challenge. I need capital. And uh, since I'm not in, in employment, it's hard, it's hard to get a loan from a bank because they require your pay slip, your monthly pay slip. Yeah. Mm. To expand my business, I'd need around, uh, roughly, around, uh, around one million shillings would be enough to establish a showroom, to have ready stock for exhibition and stuff, mm. to have a permanent employed staff, fully and guys to help me through I mean, with my work. Yeah, we've had an air um, on my registrations. I'm looking at you. KTN Job Center has pitched an appointment for Daniel Nzimbi with Hishan De Silva, CEO Vencap, a venture capital fan that has invested in over 17,000 businesses for possible funding. Joy Doreen Bira, KTN Job Center.